Hello, Gina here. Today I'm here to share my process with this week's freebie for Little Scraps of Heaven Designs. Um, I'll show you. This is the website to go to, littlescrapsofheavendesigns.com. Just click right here on free file. And then this is this week's freebie. Isn't it darling? It's so cute. So, it's called Dear to My Heart. I'll put a link to it in the video description too. I've got the deer all cut out. I'm going to be adding a page to my granddaughter's little traveler's notebook. I started keeping this a while ago just to try to keep up. I've got 12 grandkids and that's a lot to do with 12 of them. So I started the traveler's notebooks. It goes faster. This is the picture that I'm going to scrapbook. She's on her she just turned six and she got this climbing gnome for her birthday. So, and I've printed out the pink. I printed a full sheet. And then this is the other digitals. I just printed a little bit and the labels. So I'm, I have really no plan except for that. <laughs> Don't know what I'm gonna do. So let me get the picture pulled up. We'll get this made here. Let's see what we do first. I think I will do the title first. Of course, I didn't have the title ready on here. Okay. So I kind of stand up and make sure I've still got you where you need to be. I kind of moved my mat. Okay. Filming with my camera today because I downloaded a video editing program on my computer and I'm going to try to figure out how to edit video videos so it's a lot easier to get videos off my camera to my computer than it takes forever on my phone and I can't get my phone to talk to my computer so anyway this is a simple little pattern to put together Let's look. Hmm. Oh, but I didn't cut it right. Hmm. I don't quite know what I'm doing wrong there. I said a simple little pattern and then I'm having trouble with it right away. <laughs> so I hope you are all having a good day. It's Tuesday here. No rain so far today, but thunderstorms in the forecast tonight. You're all safe where you're at. Okay, jacket's gotta come off, sorry. I'm at that lovely stage in life where hot flashes. Yeah. <laughs> cockeyed there. <laughs> All right, so title done. Whoops. Hit the camera with my knee. I'm sorry. All right, let me get the deer pulled back up. So... Oops, I moved things again. We'll start with her little eye. Hmm. 
Well, I haven't really played with this. I hope. I think it goes like that. for her eyelash, I think, this way. Oh well, it'll work. <laughs> okay, now for her nose. Ear. We'll go. Oh, I just lost my B scene on my thing. I hit my mouse. That one goes about right there. And then this one. Glue on my fingers. I don't think I did that right. Hmm. I didn't have the right side of that one inked up. <laughs> okay, so for her little eye, I'm going to have to fix that little bobble there on her eye. But I'm not going to worry about it right now. Oh, it was about right there. I kind of dropped the gel pen when I was trying to put that eye on there. I think my dog is coming in here to investigate who I'm talking to. So you might hear from her in a minute. <laughs> I can hear her. neighborhood boy with the basketball must not be home today because it's been a quiet day around here. I haven't heard him out in the road with his basketball. <laughs> oh, it upsets her so much when he's out there. <laughs> I 
So I usually put the back legs on first. I don't know why. I just do. And the front goes a little bit lower. Not a lot, just a little bit. Too much glue. I don't know what is going on with my cameo. I just replaced the blade, but it seems like it's not doing a very good job the last couple of cuts. Okay. So I have to admit, she's got a couple of little dots that are smaller, and when I was trying to ink them up, they just kind of slipped right out of my tweezers and I, I don't know where they went. They were teeny tiny. So I have a little punch that makes itty bitty ones. I just punched them. I wasn't going to try to cut again just for those. So yours will have a little bit different shape. They're not quite so round. They look better than these, but I just didn't want to cut them again. Alright, so the paper piece is done. Now we'll get to working on the traveler's notebook. Get my Inking that out. Okay, so um, the way I do this is I just put a random page in. It doesn't have to be anything specific. So I think we'll go with probably this page. Yeah, this one. And I'm going to cover it with the pink. So, I need it to be, where's my pencil, this is my little trick for coming up with the, I need it to be four and a quarter, I'm going to cover this up so it doesn't matter, but I never can seem to remember, by eight and a quarter. Alright, so I'm going to cut the white down with that. Did it right. I did. My page isn't cut very straight. I think I'll put this on and then trim my page up after that. Okay, I need my gray. I thought I had my Nina card stock loaded into my printer and I must have only had one piece because this got printed thick and this was on the thinner copy paper, but I'm going to make it work. Oh, one of those dots was just right, there's one of the dots I lost. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Do you guys ever find little pieces like eyeballs in the strangest places? I hope 
I'm not the only one that does that. I find them on my slippers a lot. Okay, so now I need my scissors. Make sure I only have one page. I'm just going to trim. Now, I think I would like a white border around her. And I cut the picture at three by four. So I'll just cut my Put on that a little bit bigger. I did that right. Oh, it's crooked. I don't know what is wrong with my. I don't know if it's me or my trimmers lately. Since it's both of them doing it, I'm guessing it's user error. There we go. I bought this and didn't pay attention. I've had this happen to me before. I don't know if people use them and return them. I bought this at Hobby Lobby and I don't know if you can see. It's never been open and the glue is cleared under there. It hasn't. I hadn't opened it, but I don't know. I've had that happen to me twice now. One, I know somebody returned it and I should have known from then on to look. Because they had cut the top off of the bottle. They cut it all jagged. And I bet they didn't like it, so they just returned it. And tell them what they'd done. Okay, I gotta get that glue off my mat. I apologize, my fingers are not working good today, so I'm really fumbling. Now, I haven't quite figured out a layout for this, so I was kind of thinking her here, maybe, I don't know, something like, something like that. So, I would like, I think, to put some of the striped on there. Mm. 
You know, I think I'd like that to be a punched border or scalloped. This little thing. So. Choose. That is what's on the scallop. Okay. I'm just going to put the very edge of it. There we go. Cut it about right here. These papers, all but the white that I'm using, the pink, the striped, and the yellow. And then the labels are all part of the free file this week. So if you... Go and get the free file, you'll get these. And you can use them digitally or you can print them like I have. sure I've still even got you in frame. Okay, good. this at all, have I? That kind of boxes it in too much, I think. I don't know. I'll try using this again and see what happens. Thing. I must have sent it all flying somewhere. <laughs> all right, I don't know where my picture went. Are y'all yelling at me? <laughs> Telling me where the crazy thing went? That is weird. Oh, there it is. It's stuck to the bottom of my trimmer. Now, will that... Yeah, I don't like that. Okay, so we might not use this one. It's okay. Put that there. And this right here. do the yellow. Nope, we'll do the pink because I'm going to do the yellow washi thing.
So if you're new to Little Scraps of Heaven Designs, sorry, I just can't seem to cut and talk. Um, Trisha has a freebie every week. She changes it on Monday. And I have been trying to make a video every week showcasing the freebie. And she has a sale going on right now. I don't know how much longer the sale will be going on. But all of her paper piecings, her, all of her files are a dollar right now. So you can't beat that. And if you make something, we'd love to see it on the fan page. There's always a monthly challenge going on if you'd like to go look at that. And usually when she releases a new pattern every day, she gives a free copy to one of the lucky commenters. So you might go watch for that. Our little deer. I think I'm gonna use the fabric tack on the little deer. It's kind of hard to get that ATG on all the little pieces without tearing them apart. I wasn't thinking right. <laughs> right there. I don't know. I'll look at that for a minute. Now, to put her name. Oops. I love these little stamps, but it always takes me forever to find all the.